Happening today, Fashion Week Columbus is getting ready to announce this year's headline designer. For the past 13 years, the week gives designers here in the Central Ohio area a chance to showcase their collections to buyers around the world. Well, this morning, Fashion Week's founder and executive director is announcing the 2022 headline designer only here on Wake Up Sea Bus. Her name, Natalia Fedner, a couture designer based in Los Angeles, but grew up in Central Ohio. I'm excited to announce her because she's an amazing and very unique designer that deals with a specific type of metal textile that she is dressed uh, Beyonce, J-Lo, Shakira, Kim Kardashian, all the celebrities. And she's doing that in LA, representing Columbus, Ohio. So we wanted to know, who is this designer taking Hollywood by storm? Well, we went to Natalia's childhood home in Bexley to find out. Ala Fedner says she can't remember a time when her daughter wasn't creating something. She understood this in third grade. But it's Natalia Fedner's patent on a new so-called fabric that's creating a new buzz in the fashion world. Her designs have caught the eyes of Beyonce, Cher, Lenny Kravitz, the Kardashians, and celebrities in between. We caught up with Natalia at her studio in Los Angeles, where she told us J-Lo and Pamela Anderson were her first clients. It is an entirely metal textile that stretches in six directions. And what six directions means is sideways, so left, right, up, down, but also backwards and forwards. And what that does is it allows it to take on the shape of whatever you put it on, almost like sand. And as a designer, this is a huge blessing because it makes it so much easier to fit people, a variety of body shapes. It really has no limits. Her story just, it brings so much heart into a very sometimes uh, surfacy and shallow and pretentious industry, which is the fashion industry. And I think, and I know for a fact that we align um, because that's what we do at the Columbus Fashion Council. We're bringing heart into this industry. Natalia's story is the American dream. Her parents brought her to the States from Ukraine in the late 1980s. The family struggled at first, and Natalia says it was difficult for them to accept help early on. But that kindness from strangers is why this Bexley grad plans to host a fundraiser during Fashion Week for refugees fleeing the current war in Ukraine. I feel that... The best thing we can do when we're feeling helpless is to do something. And there's so much that can be done. So we decided to do a little something for Natalia. I think I know someone who can vouch for your story. Could you please come here for one second? Allah? <laughs> Why the internet's bad, you're at my house. <laughs> Look who I have here, your mom. So, so when Natalia first said, Mom, I'm going to LA to be a designer. I mean, what was your first instinct as a actually i supported her always yeah. she was very good artist started art, uh, drawing like from age of two year old so and was I, she always cutting up your t-shirts or things like that she does she did my husband was upset with this stuff i mean but i just i was not so upset uh, but truth is that this is why we came to this country mm -hmm. to follow our dreams and i am so proud of you, Natalia, because this is what it's all about, to come to America. So I'm so grateful to Fashion Week Columbus for giving me this incredible platform where I can continue to spread awareness and fundraise and do it in my hometown that gave me, a child refugee, so many things. I'm getting chills thinking about it. So are we. So mark your calendars. Fashion Week Columbus begins October 9th on a Sunday. A lot of events throughout the week and then the finale show on that Saturday. So really she cool was stuff. so adorable. I know. But don't ask me what to wear underneath that metal textile. <laughs> I was like, what do, you, what do you wear underneath? And you can see from the celebs sometimes nothing. What a client. We'll was. just watch for you to walk the walk <laughs> no, with that. No. Uh, I, what a cool fabric, too. Right. Like, right. It's like uh, Knights of the Round Table, eat your heart out. Right. <laughs> Chic. I could see you in you know, the little... chain link. Okay, there you go. I think All that's, right, Clay's all about it. I think it's cool. Not for me. Maybe for Ross. Maybe Ross. Ross.